that's all you got. Hi everybody, Cassie from Elusive Exclusives. I am going to dedicate today to one of my favorite rappers, Mac Miller, RIP. I did the bun and bang and it's by Model Model. It was fairly cheap. I think it was no more than $10. You can find this on your favorite online um, wigs supply stores. I don't, we don't have a appropriate wig supply out in Hawaii. So I wouldn't be able to find this out here anyway. It, like I said, I love the bun. I love the, how it looks aesthetically. I should say it that way. I don't like how it's constructed. The way it's constructed is it has like a three inch diameter circumference and it's got like a three inch diameter. So you really have to make sure your natural hair bun is pretty small and tight. So that's not the issue. Even when you, there's two combs that come in the front and the back of the bun itself. So these bangs aren't attached. So it comes with the bun itself, front and the back comb, and then a drawstring. So this mechanism, you, I thought for sure it was supposed to be make sure it looks secured and everything like that. No. Once you pull, once you get the comb secured and then you pull the drawstring, you have this bun that's kind of sitting on top. It's not sitting flush to your, the base of your hair. So I had an issue with that. I had to use bobby pins to secure it down to my actual hair. That's what I had to do and I was a little disappointed. It took a little bit more time um, to do this because this should have been like, actually doing your hair, sleeking it up in a ponytail should have been the longest part, but I felt like manipulating this bun and then playing with the bang that came with it took like 30 minutes. So the bang that came with it is not the one that I have on right now, believe it or not. The bang that came with it uh, had like a yappy looking texture and I, I didn't read this package. So when I first applied the bang, I was just like, oh, I really don't like how it looks. So I did a couple of snipping to make it try to look um, like this one is right now. And then I was just like, with the yappy texture, I was like, you know what, maybe I should try, let me just put some heat on it and bump it up a little bit more. So I didn't read the package first. I should have read the package to see if it could take heat. I put my curling iron on it and it was done, baby. <laughs> that whole bang was done. So I um, I didn't want to change my hairstyle. This was the hairstyle I had envisioned. This was a hairstyle I had for the day as far as my uh, outfit was concerned. I was like, this, <laughs> we're doing this. So I still wanted a bang and I went and got the Louis Bang and Pony by Vivica Fox. I remember I had one and thank God it was in a 1B. So I ended up cutting, because this bang is attached to this ponytail, I ended up cutting the bang off and then squishing it up under this bun and then using the remaining two combs that came with the bang to secure it to my hair. And here we are.